Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. It, um, I want to thank MPAC for uh, letting me honor my good friend Eric Treen tonight. Um, so when I met Eric, I was a uh, political appointee for the Obama administration, and I walked into the Justice Department and was introduced to this guy who had been working there for about seven years. So immediately I was very suspicious. Uh, you know, who is this guy? I found out, you know, he's, uh, he, he's got some good uh, credentials, was a graduate of Amherst College and Harvard Law School, worked at the Beckett Fund, which I knew had done some work on uh, behalf of religious minorities, and uh, had done some work in the Civil Rights Division I found out later to protect, among others, my community, the Muslim community, during a time that many of us remember was an extraordinarily difficult time for our community in the aftermath of 9-11. Eric Treen was a friend to our community in the Bush administration, in the Obama administration, and continues to be our friend today. He is a uh, renowned national expert in the Religious Land Use and Institutionalized Persons Act, which he has led enforcement uh, of that act within the Civil Rights Division for the last 17 years. And, you know, it is no secret that much of the work to enforce that act has been done on behalf of American Muslims wanting to build mosques, schools, and even cemeteries throughout the country facing opposition. Eric has been the reason that those communities have been able to build those mosques, schools, and, and uh, cemeteries around the country. And, you know, I have, in addition to working with him side by side for the last 10 years, I've had the honor of working with him on some very important cases, including United States versus Murfreesboro, which uh, many of you remember was a case where uh, a group of local neighbors had sued the county where, which had granted the right for a mosque to build, saying that they shouldn't have done so because a mosque, unlike a church or a synagogue, is not a place of worship of a religion. Islam is not, in fact, a religion. It is an ideology bent on turning America into a Sharia state. And it was Eric's uh, fortitude, his uh, brilliant legal skills, and his advocacy in person in front of a federal judge, which uh, convinced that judge to overturn a state court judge's ridiculous, unconstitutional, and un-American ruling. And, you know, it is no exaggeration to say that if it wasn't for Eric Treen, our community would not have been protected for the last 17 years. <laughs>